Hello, my name is Adam Pratt and I'm Vice President of Shearx Fastening Solutions and I want to welcome you today to the introduction of our brand new large size rivet nut installation tool, the Flex 18. The Flex 18 was designed to install blind rivet nuts in sizes up to 3 quarters of an inch and 20 millimeter. The Flex 18 is able to generate 18,000 pounds of pulling force and much like its original Flex 5 has the capability of being pulled to pressure, pulled to force, and pulled to distance. Flex 18 is able to do this by offering a pull to force valve within the tool that you are able to adjust. The pull to distance feature of the Flex 18 is adjusted by moving this stop lock at the back of the tool. You can move it in and out to change the distance that the tool will pull back to install the rivet nut. The Flex 18 has a pressure sensitive tip for spinning the rivet nut onto the tool. The tool also features a single stage trigger to activate the installation process and then the auto reverse cycle. The tool also incorporates a manual reverse should it be required. On thread sizes, 12 millimeter and half inch and smaller, the Flex 18 uses a socket head cap screw mandrel. To change the mandrel, all you have to do is remove the nose piece, then remove this casing, And inside is the socket head cap screw and the hex driver. To replace the socket head cap screw, replace a new one, put the hex driver into the tool, put the casing back on. And then put the nose piece back over the casing. Thread this till it's tight. You can also use a wrench to tighten it down further. And then position the rivet nut so that there's one thread passing through the end of the rivet nut. For thread sizes larger than 12 millimeter and half inch, you'll have to use a special mandrel. As you can see here, I have removed the nose piece and the socket head cap screw setup. With larger sizes, you will take the special mandrel, thread it onto the tool, tighten with a wrench, then take your nose piece, place over the mandrel, thread into the tool, then you'll take your anvil, place that over top, and adjust the thread length for the rivet nut that you are installing. First is hooking up the air to the booster box. Next you want to turn the valve on so that the air is flowing through the tool. You'll also notice this air gauge to confirm the air pressure that's going into the tool. To install a rivet nut with the Flex 18, first you want to be sure that your pulling force is set within the hydraulic booster box or your distance is set with the stop ring if you're using pull to distance installation. Next, take the rivet nut, thread it on to the tool a quarter turn, and then by applying a little pressure, it'll spin to the anvil of the tool. The single stage trigger, when pulled, will activate the pulling cycle and then will automatically go into reverse. So you take the tool with the rivet nut on the front, place it in your workpiece, and pull the trigger. Very easy. 
should the tool bind up in the application. You can also use one of these hand tools by placing it in the slot to move the mandrel manually. Thank you for taking the time today to join us as we introduce our brand new large size ribbon nut installation tool, the Flex 18. Should you have an application requiring large size rivet nuts, please give us a call as we'll be happy to help. Thanks.